Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. For those of you who are new, welcome, my name is Lily. Today we're gonna to be doing a quick review of my coach haul that I had about probably a month to two months ago. Um, I mentioned this in my last video, I really wanted to share some of the items I got from coach and the reason really being I haven't had items from coach for a very, very long time, but um, I was just, for some random reason thinking about these and coach was actually one of my first mid-range luxury items and it was um a gift from some of my best friends back in college so really brought back some good memories and you know the brand is actually really solid the leather is amazing i've actually seen some other youtubers um rave about some of these leather handbags as well as the slgs so i wanted to revisit that memory lane and ended up getting some of the coach items so today we're gonna be talking about them i've been using some of these already pretty consistently consistently and have been loving them um, but really overall just wanted to share with you what I got my thoughts on it and as always if you have any of these items would love to hear your thoughts in the comments below so without further ado let's go ahead and get started okay so I'm actually gonna start with the SLGs that I got this all four of these items actually came in the same order uh, but really just wanted to share with you the SLGs here and the first one I got is this card holder here it is so so pretty this color this is called it's just called the card case and I did get all of these items from the coach website not the outlet because I couldn't find some of these on the outlet and I really like this card case because you know the brand is the same color as the uh, card case itself so I love the monotone of that I would say that it's coming up on camera pretty true to color um, in person this is more like a sky blue um, and it's like this pebbled leather really smooth really beautiful very very durable this one i got for 74 dollars on the coach website and i did get it for a little bit of a discount but as always i'm going to put the links to all of these items below in the description box you can also go take a look for yourself what i want to say really quickly is that this card case is so malleable i don't know let me show you here really quickly so there are one two three slots on this front side with the um c here and on the back it's just very plain nothing on here except for an embossed of coach down here and then there's one two three card slots here and then there's a middle card uh, slot as well where you could put cash or anything else what i love about this is that it is so malleable so if you take a look right now see how wide i can open this this leather is so malleable and that's what i love about this card case because for some of the other card cases i have um especially some of the more higher end uh brands they're really not this malleable and i just wanted to show you uh in reference so i have this ysl one it's you know this is a beautiful leather and it's very durable but this these slots are a lot more I mean, I guess right now they seem pretty malleable as well, but if you actually try to stuff cards, you could fit a lot more in here compared to here. Now, if we look at the size, they're roughly about the same size, right? So they are the same size, but this is so much more malleable than this one. Price is a lot better, of course, but again, you know, you're buying for the brand here, but this is just as great a card case if you're looking for one. So I really, really enjoy this. I've been using it. You can definitely fit two cards um, per slot for each one of these. But if you put two cards per slot on this side, it's going to be a little tough to put two cards per slot on the other side. So what I have been doing is I've been putting two cards per slot on one side and one card per slot on the other side. And you can still fit in a little bit of cash in here, probably like uh, one or two bills folded. So it does get a little tight if you try to fit too much. But in comparison to other card cases, I do think this is a really really good one so here we have it it's just called the coach card case okay so the next one i have is the one i've currently been using actually in um, my small bags and it is this one it's such a pretty color um this is certainly more of a sage it's called a sage color this is more a true sky blue you can obviously tell the difference when i put them side by side this is called the win small wallet and i actually got this wallet because i don't have any super small compact wallets i did get a few couple wallets recently that i do need to do a video on to share with you but both of them are actually bigger than this and i feel like the leather here if you can tell it's like pretty much scratch resistant and that's what i love about it and there is like a small little coin um pouch in the back i'm not using it but you could certainly put coins in here so this is what it looks like in the front obviously the c is more of like a dark black color steel dark steel color and when you open it What's really nice is that there is a slot up here. So I do keep my most used credit card up here, as you can tell, and then you open up, it becomes like this. So this is a um, bifold wallet. 
Um, and then there are, it's actually really spacious if you can tell here. So there's one, two, three on this side. And there's one, two, three. And for each one of these slots, I actually have two cards in them. So uh, it's not difficult to pull these out. You know, certainly not difficult, um, but I do have two in each of these slots. So love that. And then on the inside here, you also can fit some stuff. I have some pictures here, um, Polaroid pictures here that I like to keep of people and, you know, things that mean a lot to me. Um, and then on this side, there's also another slot here, which I actually currently have empty, but it's still can fit quite a ton even with it stuffed over here and then what's really nice is that you know you do have a billfold area here I just have one dollar in here not a lot of cash and then I have a receipt in here as well so you can certainly fit your bills comfortably in here as you can tell very spacious so I really like this one because you can fold it over and it becomes this nice little small wallet but then you know you have the space uh, to be able to fit a lot of stuff in here so the reason i got this one really was um primarily motivated by my cancun trip because i was going to bring some um pesos with me but then i realized i was gonna do a different way probably use envelopes instead so i don't know if i'm gonna be bringing this wallet to cancun anymore but like in terms of the day-to-day -day use i really like um really how versatile how compact and how much it can store for being such a nifty little thing so this one is again called the win small wallet this one was 86 dollars um which honestly i feel is such a good buy so here you have it. Okay, so the next two bags, actually I haven't used at all. One of them I do plan to bring on my Cancun trip. Um, so we'll start with this one. This one, if you are familiar with it, uh, it is very, very similar in size and shape and versatility to the Louis Vuitton Felici. I think it's called a Felici bag, a uh, crossbody. This one, um, I got it in the cream color and this one is called the wind cross body so i guess it's like similar to this is all those also the wind compact this is the wind cross body although i don't know if this probably can't really fit in here it's quite big it sells the wallet but anyways i'll show you why i really like this bag um this one was 221 dollars and i don't recall if i i think that might have been the original price um so it's it's obviously pretty um rectangular and then if you look at the back what i love about it is that there is this like pouch or not pouch this back pocket here it doesn't have a magnetic closure unfortunately so you know it it doesn't give you that sort of security but if you wanted to slip receipts if you wanted to slip your phone if your phone was small enough you could certainly fit that in here um so i plan to use it for the phone but yeah and so for the metal, I did get this in the antique gold hardware. So really nice. Now, let me show you what I really like about this bag. So you open it, it is a magnetic closure. So very strong. See, you hear that? Very nice and secure. When you open it, what I think is super, super awesome, brilliant is that it has this. So like I mentioned earlier, looks a lot like the Louis Vuitton Felici um, crossbody. This comes with this, and this is what I like a lot because I plan to put my bills in here for the Cancun trip. Um, and so what's nice is you have like these three slots here. I haven't used this, so I don't know exactly how many cards it'll hold, if it'll hold double per slot. I have a feeling that might be a little too tight. So I would say that your best bet probably is one card per slot, which gives you six cards, which I think is pretty sufficient. It's plain on this side. On the back, it's plain except for the bottom. It's embossed with the brand Coach. Um, and then when you open this little zipper, which I also really like that it's this nice little um, uh, metal zip. It's not like a leather one. I feel like metal's a lot more sturdy. Anyways, you open it, it's very smooth. I love it. Um, and then you have this really nice cloth lined interior. That's this brown shade. I don't know if you can tell, but it's brown. Um, so I think this is great um, for putting your cash in here and for putting your uh, coins or whatnot. Um, it'll just like zip it up really nice and what i like is that you know that this means you don't have to bring an additional wallet you will use this as your wallet and then this is first of all let me just show you really quick what the interior looks like the interior of this one is brown so it matches with the interior fabric lining of this wallet but um this one actually is leather so it's very smooth very beautiful um and if you open it inside it's just one big pocket but what's also really nice as you can immediately tell is that there is a back pocket where you could separate um your things so i really really like that um and then of course in here it does have like the coach tab oops sorry i know it's really hard to see but that's that's what i'm pointing at over here um and so if you use this as your wallet 
you do still have space in here for like small little things. So maybe you could put like chapstick, hand sanitizer, a lotion. Um, and I think that probably would be it. Um, you might be able to put small keys in here. But again, for me, I'm using this for my trip, like on the day to day basis for my trip so i wouldn't have any keys in here this would fit me uh this would fulfill my needs very perfectly so i really really like that i just realized i forgot to um <laughs> bring the shoulder strap so give me a second i will be right back all right i'm back with the shoulder strap so i did keep this separated um and i forgot to bring it earlier but anyways this is what the shoulder strap looks like it's the same leather color of course the same um antique gold hardware and it is adjustable which i really quite like and it's you know more or less a pretty thin shoulder strap um, but you have a couple notches here. I do have it currently at the second to sh uh, shortest length here. Um, and I'm 5'4 for reference. I will show you how this looks on my frame later at the very end so you can see. But basically there's this one and this one. Now I guess the only slight improvement I could say is that this one is actually really loose and I like when I went to get this, it actually was here. So it's come off. And when that's off, you know, it kind of like dangles like this and it's not the most aesthetically pleasing um, look. So actually, if this second part was a little tighter and it could hold it at its any given location, that would have been perfect. But yeah, I think that would be the only thing. Um, I don't know if it's just my item if other folks if you guys have this whether this kind of falls off by itself or not but anyways it's not a big deal just something i thought i'd point out but let me just go ahead and hook this on so you can kind of see real quickly what this looks like and real quick here this is you know how the ends work so really quickly clicking this on here and then you have this really cute crossbody. So this one doesn't come with um, a different chain. It just comes with this uh, leather strap. Now, of course, if you wanted to alternate and choose a different type of chain or like strap to use, you certainly could do that because of the versatility here. This is detachable, so that's really nice. But in its, um, you know, original form, it does look like this. So yeah, this is the wind crossbody. Super, super cute. All right, so for the final item I have in this video is a very, very popular item Coach has been selling. And I know a lot of YouTubers, a lot of folks really love this bag and I can understand why now. Though I haven't used it yet, it like just looking at it the first time, kind of trying to see what I could fit in it, I can see why a lot of people really enjoy this one. So if you can guess what it is, it is the Cassie 19. So this one I did get in just the classic black color because surprisingly, I actually, so so let me back up a little bit i did have a couple black bags in my collection i probably should be doing an updated 2023 bag collection um you know overview of what i have currently but unfortunately i did have to get rid of some of the bags because i wasn't using it to its full potential and it probably would be you know well used in someone else's home so I did, uh, we, I did sell those bags and so i didn't have a black bag anymore in my collection um besides of course actually Sorry, I do have a black bag, but it's my Chanel 19 and that's not an everyday bag I like to use. So I wanted to get one that was a little bit more versatile. So I got the Coach Cassie 19. And this one is the um, the smaller one. Obviously, it's the smaller size. And I think this is perfect. I wanted something that was smaller because I didn't want something super big. I have quite a bit of medium and you know large bags and totes and I wanted something a lot smaller. So I thought, you know, you really couldn't go wrong with black. It's such a classic color. It's so pretty. It's that beautiful antique gold hardware again. But yeah, this one I got for $288. So for this one, what's really nice is that you have three different options to wear this bag. You could obviously hold it, you know, from the top like that. You could wear it, you know, as a crossbody, or there is another option with a chain. So let me just actually show you. I put it in here. It comes with this little dust bag. And then the chain inside, oops, too many items in here. <laughs> the chain inside looks like this. So this is a nice thick chain. And basically you could hook this chain. Um, ideally you would probably wanna remove one of these. I don't think it would make sense to have all three different straps on at the same time. I mean, you could certainly, you know, it's totally up to you. But personally for me, I probably would only have two straps on at any given time. But if you did wanna do it, 
you know, it would kind of look like this. So this chain could help you use it as a shoulder bag. And I can, of course, show you that in the um, mod shots later. But yeah, I really like this. Um, it has a back pocket, so you could definitely put your phone in here if your phone is, you know, obviously within the size. I have an iPhone 14 Pro and it fits here perfectly with the case on. Um, and so when you open this up, it looks like this. The interior is not leather lined, it is fabric lined, it's, but basically the interior is completely fabric lined. And what I really like is that there are, there's like two compartments, so there's a separation here, but each compartment is actually pretty, pretty spacious. It's not like you have a, two compartments and each one is, you know, very tiny, you can't fit too much in here. They're both really spacious. The first compartment, it's just a big black hole in here. The second one, um, you have a bigger um, area, but then you also do have a back zip pocket where you could put, you know, uh, more I uh, items that you would like to secure or so. So I really like this. And of course, you can tell this is a pebbled leather. Um, it's just so beautiful. Coach is definitely one of the brands that offer a very, very, very well priced product that is very high quality. I've used their products before. I've had their handbags. I've had their wallets and they last such a long time. Um, and continuously last such a long time. And you know what? I have very fond memories of this brand, so I decided to pick these up. But yeah, I'm really excited about this one as well. For the strap, it is also adjustable. It has this one, um, you know, uh, thing here. I'm not sure what you call this, but it's the leather clasp to hold it in place. And again, it's like loose, you know? So if this was a little tighter, I would really like it, but because it's so loose, I feel like it would fall down. And then you have like something like that. Again, not the end of the world, but just something that I thought I'd mention really quickly. So yeah, um, I, again, I have this on, oh, actually I have this on the shortest length. So um, the highest, uh, punch hole here and I do wear this as a crossbody um, at this length. Again, I haven't worn either of these handbags yet. I do plan to bring this to Cancun and do plan to use this very soon, but haven't been wearing this. I've been using my Lululemon crossbody because they're just so light, they're so easy to use and they're just casual, but I am very excited about this item and I do plan to use it very soon. So um, anyways, just wanted to share all of this with you. Oh, I forgot it does come with um, this little tag here. I think all of their bags do come with it. This one came with it as well, but I actually removed it. I didn't like the dangling part on this one. I don't know why. I think it was just because I feel like this is a smaller bag and I didn't really want too much um, on there. I just wanted it to be nice and simple. But really quickly, just to show you in terms of um, capacity in here, if I try to fit this Win wallet in here, it will fit no problem. See, I don't think, I'm not sure if you can fit a full size wallet in here. I feel that might be a tight squeeze. I don't think you can, but like for a compact wallet like that, you could definitely fit it, even though this one is, you know, quite wide. And when you fit this in here, you can close it easily. I'm sure you can fit a phone and all your minor essentials. And there you go. So yeah, I really, really think this is um, a very nice bag, um, well made. I did not get this on sale. I don't think so. I would actually advise that you wait for a sale if you're, you know, able and willing to wait. I have this bad habit where if I really like something, I tend to kind of, I tend to make the purchase. It's something I am, you know, is one of my 2023 goals to not do and just not make an impulse purchase and just wait for a sale. But I really wanted this, so I got it. Um, but yeah, I think that Coach Often does have a lot of sales, especially like the Nordstrom anniversary sale. I know one year they had the Coach Cassie on sale, but I, w I don't remember if it was the 19 or larger version. But anyways, yeah, definitely, um, you know, check out the sales, probably find yourself a pretty good deal. This is all I have for today. I hope you enjoy the video. Um, I will keep you updated as I start using these handbags and let you know sort of what my thoughts are. I am a little concerned that because this is a cream color, it's going to get dirty, but I don't have any cream bags. And I figured, well, you know, um, I probably would want to get a bag that wasn't like a couple thousand dollars. And if it did get stained, I would be extremely, extremely sad. Um, not saying that if this got stained, I wouldn't be sad. I think it's still a beautiful bag and I would take good care of it. But, you know, it's less of a heartache when, you know, it wasn't that expensive to begin with. So I will let you all know how that goes. Um, but otherwise, thank you so much for dropping by as always, taking some time out of your busy day. I really appreciate it. 
If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you are new here and like the content you're seeing, please consider subscribing. Um, and as always, please stay healthy, happy, and safe. And I will see you in my next video. Take care. Bye-bye.